Kim Jong-un is meeting Vladimir Putin in Russia. It's not the first time they've met. They met in 2019, but this time it's specifically important for both countries. Why? Well, Russia needs ammunition. Embroiled in a war with Ukraine, it's been going on for more than 18 months. They need ammunition for their artillery, ammunition for their rocket systems, and ammunition for their mortars for tactical support. Now, North Korea, sure it'll get cheap oil and cheap gas, but what above all it needs is food for its malnourished population as harvests are failing. But there's another thing that North Korea is also going to be looking forward to. And they're looking forward to asking about nuclear propulsion technology for its fledgling Navy. It recently launched what it calls a nuclear attack sub, but in actual fact is a diesel electric missile submarine. And what Kim Jong-un wants to do is convert his submarines and build new ones that are powered by nuclear propulsion, and Russia can help with this. There are limits to this cooperation. A central tenet of North Korean political philosophy is called zhushe, or self-reliance, which means there's a limit to how much they're going to rely on someone else, no matter how friendly at the moment. And for Russia, it doesn't want to be seen to be closely allied to a country whose behavior can be mercurial at times and is already a source of much friction in the Asia-Pacific region. But this is a marriage of convenience and they have things to offer each other.